and plenty of excitement around here in the Spanish capital. We're at the Estadio Metropolitano. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And we're getting ready for a quarter final second leg match in the Champions League. It's Atletico Madrid versus Manchester United. Yeah, thanks, Derek. United with plenty of work to do after the first leg. Far from over, though, if they can nick a goal in the first half and get a bit of momentum going, I think they'll fancy their chances of going through. And here are the starters for Atletico. It looks like a conventional 4-4-2. A preferred formation by Arsene Wenger when he arrived at Arsenal. Two main strikers, four across the midfield. Really important for the fullbacks to link up with the wide midfielders in this system. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. David De Gea between the posts. Paul Pogba plays with Anthony Martial on the flanks. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. The Champions League quarter final, second leg commences. The ball with Ottavio. Belotti. Ottavio. Joao Felix, Velocci, looking confident with the ball at his feet, Pogba, well who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events, no reason at all why it won't be, but might be able to set up the chance, wonderful chance, and he got to it fairly easily, Thinking to dispossess his opponent. A lot of momentum to this Atletico attack. Velocity, keeper's ball every day of the week. Saul. And here's Lamar. Saul. Lamar. Well, keep it tight, that's what both managers would have been insane. But now the opening goal's gone in. Tactics have got to change. It's with McTominay. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking it to come, you would think. Armstrong. Madison with it. Marcus Rashford, gorgeous pass from Rashford, he must finish, it should be, and he scores, oh this is so finely balanced now, they've got themselves a goal, but need another one to send this match into extra time. Well here's the replay, the keeper's made a save, but it's not good enough, it's back into play, he was first to react and it's in the back of the net. So on aggregate it stands at 3-2. This might have potential. Benassi, magnificent defending. Possession changes hands, the interception there. It's going to be United's free kick. Aaron Wan-Bissaka. Pogba has it. Marcus Rashford. Real chance. That's a fairly easy save for any keeper to make. 
And let's go to Alan McAnally because there's been a goal on the Paris Saint-Germain game. Alan? It's a goal for Paris Saint-Germain. It's been scored by Mauro Icardi. He played a lovely one-two, receiving the ball just outside the penalty area and placing it beyond the keeper. 27 minutes played, 1-0. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. It's with Saul. This might pay dividends. Martial! It's still alive. Saul. Well, might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. But it looked highly promising. Rashford, fine pass. And the defender takes care of business. Saul. Read it superbly to take back possession. Oh, goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. Manchester United throw in here. Oh, they have it again. And he took care of it defensively. Pogba. Here's Martial. The keeper completely untroubled. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Scott McTominay. The ball with Ottavio. Tremendous intuition to win it back. And fed forwards. And the alarm bells are ringing. Big chance it is. And a goal. It is, and what a significant one. They're locked together again. You just can't divide these two teams. An extra time, a real possibility. Well, I'm sure you want to see this again. Where is everybody? The defenders, nowhere to be seen. It's an open goal. Goals are plenty in the tie as a whole. 3-3. And that will do it for the first half here. Second and decisive leg of this Champions League quarter-final. And the second half begins. This might have potential. Full insufficient. And the referee has pointed to the spot. A penalty it is. And a chance for them to forge ahead. Well, that could be his final rebuke, I think. And the referee's making that absolutely clear. Well, I like that, Derek. Good referee. Nice and strong. Told the player exactly what he was thinking. Well, Derek, it's so finely balanced. You just wonder if set pieces will be the difference today. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. Giving it a try. And a timely goal to give them security and breathing room. What a chance they have now of making it through. Well, the referee's watch delivered the message to him. A good goal, and thank goodness for technology, Lee. Well, yeah, my watch says 20 past eight, but I believe his watch. And at first thought, I didn't think it was over the line, but there we can clearly see. Well, it's only just, though. Well, seven goals on aggregate. 4-3 is how it stands. Ottavio. 
Just a reminder, we have more absorbing action from the Premier League coming your way here on EA TV. It's Manchester United facing Manchester City. Well, that should be a really interesting matchup atmosphere. I'm sure we're going to get an absolute bell to Derek. Looks promising this. Crossing possibilities. Lamar cutting the ball back. Top notch tackle. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. Will they profit from this situation? Great opportunity. And a goal here for Manchester United. They are the big favourites now. Don't you just love counter-attack football? Absolutely brilliant. One key ingredient, pace. And they've got it in abundance. What they do to that defence from then on is absolutely brilliant. On a tie, laden with goals. 5-3 here on aggregate. Plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. Velocity. Spot on with that tackle. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. All in all, a broken counter-attack. Now Jimenez. It's with McTominay. Otavio now. Really good block. Marcus Rashford. Tremendous intuition to win it back. On the ball, Aspiliqueta. Well, great read there to intercept. 15 minutes remaining. Belotti is protecting it well. Easy meet. Oh, a lovely ball. Oh, that is a goal from long range. He won't soon forget. Absolutely right out of the top drawer. Let's have a look at this replay. Caught the keeper on his heels, and this is why short back lift, great strike, takes everybody by surprise. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? of work for the scoreboard operators on this tie, 6-3 on aggregate ten minutes left for play in this match Renan Lodi might really be able to trouble them here safe pair of hands, did his job Renan Lodi. It's with Saul. As clean as a whistle, that challenge. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Good numerical situation. Fine cross into the middle. And in it goes! The perfect header! Exactly what they were looking for. Well, Derek, it's all about the cross. It's perfectly weighted, and he attacks the ball. That's the key to that goal.
goal. Roberts. And it's with Gibbs White. Armstrong. Given away. Jimenez. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. Gliding through the gears. Cross fired over. Benossi. Rifled against the post, but back in play. And cleared away. There's the final whistle. The travelling fans are full of the joys because they are moving on. Well, you have to say, Derek, over the two legs, they probably deserve to go through. Doesn't get much closer than that in the end. They'll be growing in confidence the way they played. More to come, I think, for this team. Well, his performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Lee. Well, clearly the difference between the two sides today. Two goals, a really good performance. Ran into the channel, did everything right. Absolutely, 9 out of 10.